Can't ask for a better setting, better atmosphere, home opener, sold out crowd, biggest crowd, biggest crowd I've ever seen here, other than a Springsteen concert about seven years ago, where he needed a shoehorn to get in there. You need a shoehorn to get in here tonight. This place is a lot. Oh, uh, the Tigers did not play last night, but uh, didn't think it would be a factor tonight. There's the quick shot in the goal. UMass Lowell strikes first. It's one to nothing. This is Favitt. Back along the point, he's got Halt again up top with him. Now the pass. Hartley, the shot is in! The Tigers are tidying on one as that puck ever so slowly goes across the goal line. It's UMass Lowell. Big shot. Matalor with the save, the rebound put in. The shot originally goal by Chad Ruiddle, and we'll see who got the rebound, poked it back in. And for the second time tonight, UMass Lowell leading here two to one. They in front by Brenner. Goes right through the crease on the opposite end. Olavecchia couldn't catch up to it now. Here's a quick shot. Rebound in front. Olavecchia has tied this game. The freshman. Welcome to RIT. We'll tie it to it. Boy, he was fast. There's the pass save. Olavecchia right there. Gets the rebound. Right spot at the right time. And he fires it. One, now it's a five on four. Has Wetmore joining the defense. Hartley centering. Pass! It's in! The Tigers have taken their first lead of the night. Three to two. Adam Hart. I don't know how he got the pass through there. Yeah, the column's a little bigger, but I think you're right. Had to be some alums in there. The centering pass in front looks high. Well, just as we're ready to uh, call it in there as well. Trying to go short side, cannot. Babbitt, good energy, backhander in front, of the goal! Tyler oh. Brenner has given the RIT Tigers a 4 3 lead. Well, playmakers make plays. Simple as that, great pass. Brenner right there on the doorstep. Advantage RIT. It's over. We're down to only 15 seconds remaining here, though. 10 seconds remaining as now the puck goes along the near side. Opposite end, Scott Knowles. Backhander right oh. out in front, Matalora, oh no! With 1.3 remaining! The backhander in front in this crowd, all standing, ready to celebrate a victory. Instead, we're gonna head to overtime. And the Tigers will scoop it up and bring it out. Instead, it's intercepted by Edwards and sent back down in. UMass will change it up a couple skaters. There's a play and oh, big save by Matalora. Shane Matalora has just kept this game alive. That was big. Going high, five seconds. And down the ice, is this gonna go for icing? No, they're gonna wave it off. An anticlimactic uh, end to this game, John. It's disappointing with the crowd of over 10,000. People are standing around looking at each other, expecting there to be uh, something more, but uh, that is that's it tonight, folks. No shootouts. That's not NHL. Yeah. We have a nice little shootout going on our hands. That's it. 4-4 four, four our score, yeah. John. Yeah. Disappointing. Yeah, the way it ended tonight. This is going to be a, a lesson for Wayne Wilson's team tonight. Giving up that got to finish late goal. We thought the game was over. I mean, we played like the game was over, and we were sleeping, and and they scored the goal, and they didn't give up until the end. They, you know, uh, they had nothing to lose. Uh, I'm sure in the back of their minds, they were wondering if they could do it, but uh, but we gave up, and they they tied it. So it was a, a tough pill to swallow, and something that uh, we'll hopefully have to learn from right right uh, from here on out.